Apple TV. I'm here with Joanna Neary. How are you doing? Very well, thank you very much. I don't know your name. Lucinda, nice Lucinda, to meet you. Hi. <laughs> Sorry. So tell us a bit about your show. It's character comedy and it's based on Celia Johnson from Brief Encounter oh. and a little bit of Joyce Grenville thrown in. And it's a woman who's putting on a show to raise money for the animal hospital. And she shouldn't really be doing a show because she doesn't know anything. All right. And Mrs. Betterson, the pianist, has dropped out. So she's got a heavy metaler guitarist to come and do the jingles, which she doesn't really approve of. So it's a character <laughs> comedy show. It's a little bit like the world of Count Arthur Strong. Do you know okay, that kind yeah, of... Yeah. Um, that's what I heard last night from the audience anyway, so... Oh, brilliant. Yeah. So yeah, is it just you in the show? Does that make any sense to you? That yeah, no, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I have a musician in the show. Oh, cool. He's sitting over there. And he plays Hi. guitar. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, we do jingles like, um, you know, Van Halen and, um, oh, cool, and Toto yeah. and sort of rock bands music um, with, you know, local adverts. To, yeah. Brilliant. So how show. would you sort of describe your style of comedy in the show? It's quite surreal. It's um, very sweet and it's barbed. And okay. the thing about my character is because she's so lovely. I'm, I, I know my voice sounds a bit weird because st I'm starting to go a little bit into character. <laughs> but when I think about her, you know, it goes yeah. in my head. But, um, but it's a dark side to it, you know. Mm. Like, I really love Viz mm -hmm. and, um, and uh, Frank Hovis. But you won't know Frank Hovis, I don't suppose. Um, so, it, so the character is very, very sweet. Um, but it's not a completely whimsical show mm -hmm. because the heavy metal uh, brings a bit of an edge to it. Yeah, Does that course. make sense? Yeah, no, it sounds really cool, that actually. Like, <laughs> I keep saying that makes sense after everything. Sorry about that. No, it's all right, <laughs> all right. So is this how many times have you been at the Fringe? I think this is maybe my eighth or ninth time. Wow. I'm not really so you're sure. Like a veteran now. <laughs> yeah, on and off for over the years. Yeah. Brilliant. Yeah. So how do you feel like you sort of changed since you first started coming? Do you feel like you're a lot stronger now? or? Yeah, um, when I first came here, I was probably 23, wow. and so and I wasn't paying for the show, so mm -hmm. we spent all our money on beer <laughs> and spent all the time flirting That's with the fringe. bar staff at the Pleasants <laughs> and everything. Yeah, it was a very different fringe. Yeah. And now that we're older and we have a family, it's a different, different thing. We'll go to the mm -hmm. children's shows, you know, and be a bit oh, more lovely, sensible. Yeah. And I'm flying. I didn't fly for years because I find it quite harrowing. But, um, it is, yeah. It is quite <laughs> harrowing, isn't it? But um, yeah, no, it's, it is a different experience, but it's really great. And I've never noticed before how beautiful Edinburgh is. Yeah. I've only just noticed this year. I mean, it's always felt like Land of the Giants mm -hmm. because I'm from Cornwall where there's small cottages and everything's huge here, isn't it? Of course, and, yeah. And black bricks and things. It's quite imposing when you're nervous about your show. Yeah. <laughs> but this year I've noticed it's such a beautiful city and there's so much green and the river and so much space. Yeah. Really, oh, really enjoying it. Brilliant. Mm. So why do you think people should come and see your show and how do you sort of want them to feel when they come out and everything? What's the sort of impact that you want your show to have? My show isn't really like other shows. It's, it's one character and so you come into a world and it's really lovely because we see the audience's eyes kind of get, get taken away with it and people have said that they'd like to know more about the characters. They don't want it to oh, end cool, when it yeah. ends. They want to carry on and find out even more, which is a lovely thing to hear, isn't it? Yeah. And um, people go away kind of surprised that they loved it so much and I think that means my flyers aren't very good oh. <laughs> because they're not describing the show. Do you know people came last night and they came not knowing what to expect and uh, were really, really delighted that they loved it so much. Brilliant. So, so I'm very pleased with the reaction I'm getting. Yes, it's, it's really nice. Fantastic. But well, yeah. thank you so much for coming and speaking <laughs> to us. Thank you for having me here. You've been watching Waffle yeah. TV, sponsored by Bulmers. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>